18-year-old DJ Hudson of Conway likes going to the beach but gets bored just sitting there. He wanted something new to do. So one day he found some buckets and bocce balls at home, headed to the beach, and Myrtle Ball was born. I got the scoring system kind of based on cornhole, but I added my own little Myrtle Ball twist to it, and then that was the same deal with bocce ball and things like that. The goal of Myrtle Ball is to score points by tossing colored balls into buckets buried in the sand. One point for the big bucket, three for the smaller one. The winning score could be 15 points or whatever the players decide. It's a simple idea, but DJ's friends say it's awesome. And it's just like cornhole, the whole setup, the whole point system. And it's just a different feel since it's on the beach. It's really cool. DJ says Myrtle Ball is an improvement over other beach games because it doesn't require much room to play so it doesn't bother other people. And it's safe, no one getting hit in the face by a frisbee or football. DJ and his friends say every time they take Myrtle Ball out to the beach, they end up being surrounded by people who come up to them and ask, what are you guys playing? We were set up kind of a, along the pier. We had about a crowd of 30 just surrounding us. We had people up in the pier watching us, and ev that's been consistent every time. DJ says all the parts, including the mesh bag, cup, and shovels, are American-made. So far, he's only sold them on his website, but he's working on getting them into local beach stores. I can attest the game is fun and easy to play, even for an old guy. In Myrtle Beach, Joel Allen, WPDE, News Channel 15.